Welcome. In front of me is a Oppo Reno 12FS and today I will show you how you can import contacts from your SIM card to the phone. Get started. Open up your standalone contacts application, which there is one located in Google folder. I'm gonna skip signing in and in here we're gonna navigate to fix and manage. Now actually before I go to the import I am gonna quickly mention something so right now you see an empty contacts list and it's trying to pull contact from the phone now if you have a google account obviously this will show you your google account like letter or icon and you can click right here no matter what it's showing you and change uh, to a couple different locations like your sim card uh, different google accounts and also the device now chances are if you don't have any contacts on your device this will not be visible at all uh, but because i don't have any contacts whatsoever in here it's still showing it. In any case, I'm gonna now select fix and manage to begin our import and then I'm gonna select manage sim. This will display all the contacts that are located on my sim card. Now there's again a little bit of discrepancy on how this will look like on your end compared to how it looks like on mine. Most people obviously have a Google account signed in on their phone and in such a cases between the first contact, which that would be one for me, and the manage sim option, you will have a drop down menu and by default it will select your Google account. You can drop down there and select something like your device. Now because I don't have the option to import contacts to the Google account as there is no, no Google account signed in, it automatically defaults to the only option that I have access to which is the device itself. That's why it's not giving me any kind of drop down. Now additionally, if you see some kind of contacts grayed out and deselected, don't worry, these contacts already exist on your contacts list and the phone is stop it, preventing you from importing duplicate contacts. Now uh, additionally, you can also deselect contacts that you don't want. Now with that being said, once you have everything prepped, selected that you want, click on import. Uh, this asks us if you want to keep or delete the contacts from the SIM card. I recommend keeping them. They don't get in your way and they are there as a safe backup if anything would ever happen to your contacts list, your phone or anything. So I would be choosing keep. And now we can navigate back to contacts and you can see all the contacts that I have imported. Now, with that being said, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.